Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I thought I would actually kind of vlog for you guys the next few days. I've been really, really busy and I have the next few days off and so I have a lot of stuff I need to get done and I'm not gonna have time to do like a sit down video and film. I still wanna try, but I don't know if I'll get to, so I thought I'd kind of vlog. But I got up really early this morning and drove, I had to get horse feed, um, flax meal for them, and then some like alfalfa pellets cause grass and stuff's not growing right now and they've got hay, but you know, just for a little extra cause it's supposed to get down to, in like the twenties. But um, yeah, I went and I picked up all of that and my dad rode with me and I just honestly forgot to take my camera and I was like, I should have taken it. And I also had to pick up um, Zena's like little chews. So Zena is 10. She turned 10 in February and she has like really, really like bad breath over the last few years. And where she's older, they don't like want to put her under just to like clean her teeth. Cause I guess as dogs, you know, like get older when you put them under, there's like more of a chance of, I guess I'm not coming out of it. I don't know. So I had to do some research and these are working really, really well. So she really likes these. Um, it's just one a day. These are, hold on tell you at the receipt right here um $21.99 for these which I think is pretty good because like I said I think there's like 40 in here yeah there's 45 chews in here so again it probably took me about two weeks before I started noticing a difference in her breath but Zena doesn't really even have like a lot of plaque and stuff so I'm not sure but she also has her yearly visit this month as well so gonna kind of see what's going on but otherwise she's you know, I feel like to be 10 years old, she's still moving and doing really good. But I um, picked up that and then just some other stuff I had to get today. Like I was, like yesterday I used like the last bit of my, of my horse feed. But uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm really, really tired. <laughs> so um, kind of got to keep going. But I just got to unload all the feed into the tractor and drive it down to the barn. It's like super muddy. So and I don't really want to have to carry it. So I'm just going to drive the tractor be like a little bit lazy about it today. Um, but I am going to make me a coffee because I didn't make me one before I left today because I just didn't have time. Um, like I said, my dad went with me and he had to get back um, to help my grandmother. But yeah, so this is going to be a vlog over the next few days. I have quite a bit of stuff that I do have to get done around here. Um, I My strawberry plants come in. And it's supposed to get down like 29, so I don't want to plant them yet next week. So I'm hoping they'll survive. But I did get these like metal boxes that I got off of Amazon that I want to put together because I planted a hundred last year strawberry plants in the garden. And it's like the moment they started coming up and doing good, the deer and the groundhog ate it. I'm trying to see if I can get a fence up there, but <sighs> everything is just so expensive. <laughs> Never really notice what you want With you I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palms Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free You know I'm addicted to you And it's twisted you've been gifted with the evil voodoo Got me coming back for more even when I've been screwed Dolls full of pins, pierce my heart straight through so I was actually trying to film carrying this stuff in and show you guys feeding, but as you can hear, hitting the tin roof, it started raining, so I can't really keep my camera out there right now. Um, but I'm just getting ready. Just finished with our feed. I'm getting ready to throw some hay out there. I'm just trying to kind of wait till it slows down just a little bit. But I'm definitely out of breath because I was trying to get all those bags and stuff over here before everything got wet. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> sorry I couldn't film more of that but um i'll try to film that another day i got issues in my head i like you in my bed but you keep me on red oh everything is like a test i better not text or i'll come off desperate but if i lay down and i play dead and i stay dead baby you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head under my bed think you're something 
All right, so I'm hoping that the wind's not so loud that you guys can hear me, but I've now started on the second one. I will say the first one, I broke several with the screw shaft, so just tighten them, I feel like, very gently by hand. Um, first one took me a lot longer than I care to admit, but everything has to be like flipped a certain way for like the corners. I'll show you when I get them both set up, and then I'm gonna take the backhoe, and a bunch of trees had fallen down up here, and there's like, it brung up like all this dirt. It's like really good dirt, so that's what I'm gonna use to fill these boxes in. I got the other one sitting over there. I've already put up, and then I put the other one right behind me. But, um, I got one of my little chickens out here chilling with me. She, um, like, I don't, we're not exactly sure what happened, but somehow she lost a toe, and the other chickens were really mean to her, so we kept her separated inside, and then it healed up. We tried to put her back in there, and they were just like, really attacking her so we're having to keep her separate um she has a little bit of a limp but she's still doing good um yeah i'm gonna finish this and like i said i'm so sorry if you can't hear me if you can't hear me i'll probably do like a voiceover on this part but the reason i went with the metal ones i'll link these are from amazon you don't have to follow that link but if you're looking to where i got these i think both of them were like 90 dollars really expensive i mean they're flimsy but like I've had wood ones and even with like painting the wood ones I just feel like the bottom just rots so quickly so I decided to go with metal ones this year and give this a try. Alright I'm gonna hopefully you guys can hear me because the wind is blowing really hard but as you guys can see they're I mean they're flimsy but I think once we get dirt in there it'll be fine. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get off it. Yeah sorry. <laughs> That's my cat. I'm gonna go ahead and go get some dirt because I definitely, like I said, have to have dirt in here. These are going to blow away tonight and it's already getting pretty late. But I got the second one together pretty quick once I figured out how the first one went. So yeah, that's what they're looking like. them filled with some dirt just filled them just like a little bit higher than the edges because it'll settle I'm not gonna get the strawberries done today but tomorrow's my last day off so I'm gonna try to get it done and then I kind of got started doing some laundry and getting things ready for the work but I'll show you guys once we have them all planted tomorrow and this will be another project officially done guys um so i'm probably going to go ahead and end this vlog today um just with everything i do today i'm actually getting ready to put a little chicken coop together i actually have one down there right there if you guys can see it you can like pull it and move it but i went down to the coop and one of my chickens i noticed there was like blood everywhere and the white leghorns had was like attacking her and like had completely ate off one of her toes and then the same thing with the rooster I don't know like what happened or like what's going on but like we separated them and they healed up really nicely and the moment we put them back those two back in the coop they just like went out at them again at their feet and it's just the white leg horns I have brown leg horns and then um I'm trying to think of the other ones but I don't know what has caused that or what's going on but I temporarily bought a coop I'll put it together and tell you guys what I think of it and the price and stuff but it's just something temporary and until I can get another one built to kind of separate those white leghorns because I do seem to be the only one that's doing it so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and put that together and I'll show you guys when I'm done